Hello one and all, this is Sir Hawkeye. Welcome back for another episode of Monster Hunter Generations. In the last episode, we fought the owl with the Abdep style of the hammer, and it was so cool. It's probably my favorite, favorite, favorite style to use now because the dodging thing is actually amazing. The fact you get through you can go through screams, hits, and any sort of attack like that as well. And actually your allies can help you out as well by planting bombs, you can jump through them to get the proc anywhere as well. But no, anyway, let's play some more monster hunt, shall we? In today's episode, we're gonna be hunting the Slay the Great Macho Team, whatever you want to call it, because dyslexia is amazing. But now, I'm going to be doing Hammer one last time, but I'm going to be using a thing called Striker. About Striker, Striker style is the Valentine's Day and somebody use style at the left to equip. You basically get three Hunter Arts as well, so you get Spinning Meteor, Provoke, and Absolute Evasion. I'm not actually tried this one out yet. This is what this is the thing you get for it as well. Spinning Meteor, Provoke, and Absolute Evasion. I wonder what Provoke's about, because I've seen like, Provoke if it's MMO terms, you're provoking the enemy to mainly focus you. And for a for a hammer user, I love that because you want to be able to get the monster's attention. Because what I can work with hammer users know when the, the monsters kind of do like a two shuffle, don't they? They go but they for instance, if they charge for your teammate or they miss you, they get back up and go, one, two, and they look at you. Or you can just you know, you get the perfect hit on their face, which is great because the hammer you're supposed to go for the face. So, spinning me into your provoking absolute evasion. I want to see what like, absolute evasion like as well because I'm not seeing the game. So, um, we're f fighting the raptor. So, let's freaking do this. Yeah. Ever. Oh, wow. Oh, this new map though. This is. This is something. Wow, what is this map? Look at that, it's so cool. I like this already. Okay, let's go ahead and straight down then. He is in area five. Whoa, look at these dudes. Oh my God, look at them. Oh wow, these guys are kind of like the, the natural resource for meat that I'm assuming. But that's really cool. My gathering muscles are pure mouth, god damn it. Okay, let's head up straight up here and kill the massive I'll say massive the raptor. Oh my god, okay, this is clearly a giant arena for like a massive monster. We're just fighting monsters. Okay, here's like the mainly the, the, the basically the alpha raptors like minions, as you may get. Let's build up my my stuff. Okay, I'm looking on the right hand, left hand side, you guys can't see it because I don't want to like hug up the screen with it. The absolute evasion is basically getting more of a proc than anything else. Okay, with striker class, you cannot do the triple pound. You do one, two, and you can't do any more, and you can't do any more. That is it. That's all you can do. You can't do the uppercut swing. Okay. All right. Okay. <clears throat> I kind of like that because, like, you know, it kind of balances out classes as well. Okay. 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 There he goes. Right, my absolute evasion is almost ready. Okay, when, I, when they are done, I will just proc them to see what they do, because I'm quite curious. Okay. Oh, he went to the next area. Area 4. Okay. Ah, oh, this is like an old hunter camp, but it got destroyed. That sucks. Rip to the hunters. You know what monster I'm just fighting? The Demboros. He's so cool. Oh, whoa, hello, buddy! Oh, he goes in. oh my god, he goes this Okay, absolute evasion is ready. I'm assuming you pop it as he tries to attack you. Okay. Ooh, okay. That's like kind of like adept, but like you can dodge everything, anything. That's intro. Okay, oh yeah, okay. oh yeah, you do only do three pounds instead. Okay, I've not got okay. Oh, we went flying! I hit him in midair somehow. You can only do, okay. you can only do like, you, you do three pounds instead of the upper swing. Okay, my provoke is nearly ready and spinning, and the spinning um, meteor is about halfway. I love, I love that what he does, it's like kind of like on his back tail, okay, absolute evasion is already. But the charge is quicker as well, the charge is a lot quicker it seems anyway. Absolute evasion is now ready. Provoke is now ready. This is what provoke looks like. It's the third skill in the slot. Okay, I've got provoke on. Do I actually have to hit the monster with provoke or what? Because I look like an uppercut move. I ow. Okay. 
Is he, is he actually after me now? I'm not really sure. The best way to actually test is if we're actually hunters. I dodged through that? How? Oh, I just I popped absolute evasion. Now for the backswing. You, can, you could keep, just keep comboing this, which is quite good. You could be doing the pounds. And you just bring it back a bit. I got, got the spin, though. I love the new effects with the hammer. It's like, proper... Feels like you're swinging a, a, a really heavy weapon. Okay, absolute evasion is now ready. Spinning meteors up to up in a second as well. Okay, spinning meteor is ready. Boosh! Okay, I didn't kill him. Okay. I love that. That animation's really cool. It'd be quite cool to actually use, but it's kind of annoying that it's on the bottom of the screen. That's going to take some getting used to, that is. The reason why I'm not, oh, God damn, the reason I'm not got the bottom screen on here because I don't want to kind of like spoil like the gameplay. I know a lot of I know a lot of people do have it, but I personally don't like having it on because I like to have like all the attention on the gameplay. Absolute evasion is on my stuff as well. I like how the fact is depending where you hit them, like how hard you. Ow, Jesus! How hard you actually hit them, your base, your bar fills up quicker. If you like get him in like a weak spot, like the face or whatever, like, absolute evasion is now ready again. And he's calling some more reinforcements. Provoker's almost ready. He's, he's stunned again. Jesus Christ. See him get provoke off. Okay, Provoker's ready. Okay, I got his attention, apparently. Where's he running to? Where are you going, bro? I just provoked you. You have to come on to me until unless the DPS or the healer you know, gets aggro. I've played my monster hunter. I can stun him actually. I might finish him off with the stun. That is the plan anyway, to finish him off with the paralyze. Do it. Do it. Do it now. Where are you going? The music's amazing. Oh, I hit him with three instead of. Oopsie. Okay, back we go. I kind of like this, like the position. Ground pound. Oh, he's hungry, which is sad for him. Man, you see, I feel bad for him. I love, I do love when they're tired because they completely get so sluggish. I absolutely love it. I love it. Okay, he's angry now. Okay, no more sluggish for being, no, no him being sluggish then. Nice. Okay, he's reek. He's weaky weak. Okay. Oh, okay. Alrighty. Okay. Oh, shoot. Roulette video. Oh, I should I should have hit absolute evasion. Oopsie. Okay, I popped it, but you can't you can't of course you can't just spam it. All my stuff's ready to use. Absolute evasion. You kind of put your weapon automatically away as well. You can't get knocked out though. That's quite cool. Your, your light attacks can't affect you. Oh, he moved out of the way for a split second there. Where is he? Come on, die already. He's stunned. I've stunned him quite a bit. Poor guy. There he goes! Down for the count! Yeah! That is the hunt, guys. I hope you enjoyed this fight as well. Of course, in the comment below, what would you like me to weapon use? Use weapon. Yes, stuff.
But anyway, guys, just comment below what weapon you want me to use and what style, and I'll get around to it. Or, what you guys might like maybe as well, what I did just think about then, I can kind of do like a mini roulette series out of this. So I'll get like four people, kind of the same thing about just weapons and styles. The monsters doesn't really matter, we'll just go against the Nagakuga and make it a bit interesting because four on the Raptor with the quest to be over in seconds. So let's fight the Nagakuga with weapons we just like to use. But anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode of Monster Hunter Generations, a demo. Take care of guys and have an awesome day, okay? Bye-bye.